Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a body lotion and shower gel bath stuff declutter video. So I hope you enjoy it. If you do, please give this, a vid uh, this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Let's get into the declutter. Okay, so this box has all my body lotions, um, bath stuff, shower stuff. So I'm just gonna um, grab out all my body lotions first, um, just because I know there's a lot more of those than there are anything else. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna pull them out and get decluttering. Um, I believe that is it. So all this stuff here is all um, body lotions. So yeah, we're just going to go through it together and I'm going to pick out some bits I want to keep and get rid of the bits I'm going to get rid of. Uh, so the first thing I, I know I'm getting rid of is the Righteous Butter by uh, Soap and Glory. I have used it a few times, um, so this one is going straight in the bin, but I'm just not a fan of the smell. Um, so yeah, this one is going. Uh, next up is the Body Shop Frosted Berries Softening Body Gel Lotion. I love a gel lotion and I think they're really, really good, so I'm hanging on to this one. Uh, next up is a, a Pink Peppered Luxurious Body Lotion by Abbott and Broom. Um, I've never used it um, and it does smell very nice, um, but it's just not a product I'm going to be keeping. Uh, next up is the Bayless and Harding Beautycology Bink Pink Peppermint Candy Swell Body Butter. Um, again, this is a completely brand new product. I've never used it. Um, I don't know what it smells like. I want to know what it smells like. Okay, so that's the paper card bit. Um, anything I'm, I don't keep, I will be popping on Depop. So, Mm, yeah, I'm not a fan of the smell. I have just opened it slightly there, but I'm just not a fan of the smell. Um, so I will pop that back on and that one will be being decluttered. Next up is the Toasted Marshmallow by Beautycology. Um, again, it's completely brand new, but I don't know what it smells like. So I am just going to give it a quick sniff and then I will be able to tell you whether I like it or... Oh, no, I like this one. I like this one, so I'm keeping this one. Um, yeah, that one's being kept. This one I've had for a super, super long time. This is the Enecto uh, Pure Coconut Moisture Cream. Um, it is, like, really old. I've had this a really long time. Um, it st still smells lovely, um, but it is just super old, so this one is going. Uh, next up is the Avon Far Away Infinity Body Lotion. Um, again, I think this one is... Oh, no, it's not brand new. I have used it. Um, I don't think I like the smell. It's okay. Um, I don't know. I'm going to put that on the maybe pile for now because I just don't know about that one. So maybe it's over here. Uh, next up is the Bayless and Harding Wild Blackberry and Apple. I have the body spray of this and I'm just not a fan of it. So this one is being decluttered. Next up is the Be Enchanted Body Lotion. Um, I must have got this in the little set. I don't know quite where it's from, but this one is going. Uh, next up, all oh, these are new. These are the Chantry, no, Champneys, my bad. Uh, Champneys Summer Dream Rewarding Body Butter Souffle, um, Heavenly Days, and citrus plush. I'm keeping all of these. I bought these in a set at Christmas. They're completely brand new so I'm hanging on to those. Um, I have a Jack Wills English Velvet Body Butter. Um, it is completely brand new. I have never opened it but I know I like the smell of the body spray. Um, so I'm hanging on to this one. Next up I have two Ted Baker body lotions that I got in a set a while back. Um, yeah, I'm hanging on to both of these. They don't say what scent they're in. Um, but yeah, I love the packaging and I think they're really nice. So I'm hanging on to those. Uh, next up is the Body Butter by Dirty Works. I think, uh, yeah, I mean, I've never used it. 
it is brand new but again it's another one I just don't like the smell of um, so this one will be going next up is one I bought recently this is the Vaseline Intensive Care Spray Moisture with Aloe Vera um, it's a really nice product and I love the fact you can spray it out it was a little bit expensive but I'm hanging on to it Next up is the Waitrose Baby Bottom Butter. Now you're probably wondering why I have this if I don't have a baby, but this is actually really good for your bum. Um, like if you shave or anything down there, it's really good. It's moisturising and it stops the itch. So I'm hanging on to that. Uh, next up is the Plum Pudding by Beautycology. Again, it's another one I got in a set at Christmas. I don't know what it smells of, so we are going to open it up and give it a sniff. Um, no, I like the smell of that one, so that one is staying. Oh, it's not that I can get the lid back on properly. Nightmare. Okay, so I have another two. Oh, I have another one from Champneys, so that one is also staying. I have a Ted Baker body souffle. I believe this is yep brand new. Um, so I will be hanging on to that. Next up is a Sanctuary Spa Covent Garden Silky Smooth Body Lotion. Um, this one is going. I do like Sanctuary Spa, but um, yeah, I didn't like this scent, if I remember rightly. Yeah, it's just not my favourite, so this one is going. Next up is the Body Shop Satsuma Energising Gel Lotion. I absolutely love the smell of Satsuma, so this one is staying. Um, this is another one I bought recently, again Palmer's, if you know me, Palmer's is one of my favourite brands, not sponsored. Um, but this is the um, cocoa butter formula, I do have the coconut one as well which is incredible. Uh, next up is the patisserie cranberries and cream hand and body lotion. Um, yep, I like it, so this one's staying. Uh, this one I actually picked up from Superdrug a little while back because everyone got one in a box and I didn't have that beauty box. Um, so this is the Fizzy Berry um, from Philo or Below um, and it's just great. I love this. I am actually going to get rid of this one because I have still got the smell on my hand and I just don't like it. It's too strong. So that one's going. Uh, next up is the Dr. Botanicals Coconut Oil Rejuvenating Body Exfoliating Bar. I'm getting rid of this one just because I have one in my shower and yeah, I just don't need it. So that one is going. Okay, so let's move ooh, Let's move on to um, shower gels and body scrubs and bath stuff. Uh, next up. So the first, well, next up, the first thing is the Lynx Body Wash Attract for Her. This is a really nice body wash. Got it in the set for Christmas. So this one is staying. Um, then I have the Pretty and Witty Body Wash. Um, yep, that one's nice. Quite like the smell and the packaging is really cute. So this one is staying. I have the Champneys Well Earned Treat Summer Dream Rewarding Bubble Heaven. So this goes as a bubble bath. I have two more of these. I have the Cloud Nine one, which is really nice. And I also have the Heavenly Days one, which again is very nice. Um, I have the Wild Blackberry and Apple Refreshing Shower Gel again. I didn't like the scent of this, so this one is going. Um, then we have the Glazed Apple by Body Shop Sugar Scrub. Um, whoop. Can you see it? Um, this one actually smells really nice, so I'm hanging on to this one. Um, then I have a Be Enchanted Body Polish. I think I've used this one. Uh, whoop! No, I haven't. It is a body scrub. I thought I'd used it, but it's not, so I haven't. So this one is going to be going. Um, then we have these. I got these. Oop! I got these in a set at Christmas, um, and depending on the smell, um, I will keep them or declutter them, because um, they don't have a film over them. Um, so that one's really nice, that's the strawberry and raspberry one, so I will hang on to that. Oh, lime and ginger, 
it's quite a strong scent if you like limey citrusy products you'll like that one so that one's going the fruity coconut body scrub i think i'm gonna like this if it smells like coconut yep it smells like coconut we're fine <laughs> next up is cherry and almond that one smells quite nice but i'm not sure about that we'll leave that there for a minute and then orange and satsuma which i'm pretty sure i'll love yep smells incredible uh, so i will be hanging on to that and i'll probably hang on to this one as well the smell doesn't hurt me so we'll hang on to that um then i have the little body washes that go with them so i'm gonna get rid of the lime and ginger one and i will be keeping the other four sorry about the sun guys it is awful today i will try and get the lighting okay uh, then we have the pretty and witty bubble bath which i'll hang on to um, some little bath salts, which are quite cute. I'll hang on to those. And then I have the Mix and Fizz Bellini Mojito and Martini Shower Gels. These are, again, another one from Superdrug. Um, depending on the smell... Oh, no, they're sealed. I'm not going to open them, actually, because I reckon they'll be fine. So this is the stuff I'm hanging on to. And then this is the stuff I'm decluttering. I feel like I've done okay with this. Um, so we had the soap, the lime and ginger stuff, the Be Enchanted bits, uh, Dirty Works. This one I'm binning because it's really old. Um, this one I'm also binning because it's really old. These two, new. Uh, Sanctuary Spa, new. This one, new. You guys saw me open it. The Avon Far Away one, which I think I've used once. And then the pink pepper pod one. Um, but yeah, I think that is everything for this set of decluttering stuff. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then you should definitely subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys soon. Bye!